Hi, I'm Mo, and I'm trapped in Fallout. Today, I'm going to show you how to recruit Clover, a permanent companion. Clover can be recruited from Paradise Falls. Paradise Falls is directly north of Arafu. Once you're at the entrance to Paradise Falls, just go ahead and go inside. Now, if this is the first time you're here, you will be stopped by Grouse. He is one of the guards. You will need to pay him 500 caps in order to be able to enter Paradise Falls. Once you've done that, just follow this path and then go through the doors you see over there. Once inside, we will need to go and speak to Eulogy. Eulogy holds the quote-unquote contract for Clover. The only way to buy the contract off of Eulogy is to actually have a karma level of evil. If your karma level is not evil, then you will not be able to recruit Clover. So once your karma level is evil, go ahead and speak to Eulogy. You must be our prospective customer. We make no judgments, no... Now, was there something... Go ahead and select the first option. I'm in the market for a bodyguard. You gotta be careful using a slave. You're in luck. It... Select the first option again. Why sell her? Have you seen this place? And again, the first option. What makes her so special? I'll tell you why. Because crazy in a fight, and for the low cost of a thousand cap. Eulogy will offer you to sell Clover's contract for 1,000 caps. If your barter skill is high enough, you will be able to purchase a contract for 500 caps instead. Whatever option you're given, go ahead and select it. I ought to sit Clover on you, just to show who's bought. But you're right, so go ahead and have fun with And with that, you should now be Watch able up. to recruit Clover. Oh, go ahead and speak to her. To My name's Clover. I hear you're the new man in my life. You're looking for a bodyguard? And with that, you should now be able to ask Clover to let's go. Whatever you say, honey. As said, to recruit Clover, your karma level will need to be at least evil. She is tagged with barter, melee weapon and small guns, meaning that she is an agile and quick companion. She also considers herself to be pretty much crazy in love with whomever holds her contract, meaning that you will have some interesting dialogues with her if you take her on your journey. It is also important to note that if you steal too many things after you recruit her from Paradise Falls, she will actually turn hostile and she will make you a target. Also, if you kill all the slavers in Paradise Falls before you recruit Clover, she will turn hostile forever and there will be no possible way for you to recruit her anymore. And this was a simple and quick guide on how to recruit Clover.